What's going on guys, it's your boy Crazy Spartan here, and as always before I get started off with the video, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support that you guys have been offering on the channel. Uh, if you guys haven't checked it out, episode 20 of the Baby KD series is on the channel now, so go check it out. Uh, I uploaded it uh, sometime last night. Uh, yeah, it went live nine hours ago, so uh, definitely go check it out, it's on the channel. But regardless of that... Today, I'm going to be talking about some things I want to see in uh, the Season 3 Reloaded update, or I guess in Season 4. Season 3 is probably the best season that we've gotten so far. Uh, season 1 was kind of boring. Uh, not even going to lie to you guys. Uh, season 2 kind of changed up things a little bit you know it added some stuff to the warzone map i mean i don't even play warzone uh, i'm not gonna play a hacker infested game mode and uh you know, kid girls running around uh you know uh sniffing g fuel and uh adderall and uh stealing their mama's credit cards for cop points getting killed by them but regardless of that i think season three this season that we're in right now is the most complete uh how do you say it? it's the most complete phase of the game that we've seen in the last six months of the game been out i think uh the game came out what was it october november so december january february march april may so yeah six months of the game being out and this is the most complete game of cold war that we've gotten so far but regardless of that I guess some things, I guess we're going to talk about some things that I want to see, alright? Honestly, uh, I love the fact that they're introducing all these new weapons, you know what I'm saying? The meta changes every single season, uh, you know, there are some metas that are still around there, uh, the Diamatis were, you know, at one point the meta, the DMR was one point the meta, uh, you know... M16s and AUGs and everything like that. I love the fact that they're adding a lot of new weapons to the game. And uh, it's switching up a lot of the variety, which is cool. Alright. Uh, as far as the maps. So, I believe the only original maps that we've gotten so far are the Pines. Uh, we've gotten Apocalypse. We just got Diesel. And we just got Yamantau, which... Actually, Yamantau isn't even really original. It's more like a, a reskin version of the uh, campaign mission back in Black Ops 1 and in Black Ops Cold War. I kind of like the fact that they added some new maps, you know what I'm saying? Uh, they're going to add a lot more remakes to the game as well. Uh, ready to see st uh, Standoff. I believe that's coming in the Season 3 Reloaded update, so that may be in the next couple of weeks here. And, uh, you know, really ready to see a lot of the, you know, older classic maps come back. You know what I'm saying? Standoff is one I'm ready for, definitely. Jungle would be really, really cool to see how that would play out. Uh, definitely would love to see more Black Ops 2 remakes come out. Uh, definitely more World of War remakes. They should just start remaking maps like, you know, or remastering maps, if you will, because remaking them will change the layout of the map. I kind of, I, I, you know, I kind of honestly love the fact that they didn't change Nuketown. They didn't add doors to the map, so I'm glad, I'm glad that Treyarch didn't do that. That's one thing about Treyarch. They have better maps than Infinity Ward, but Infinity Ward's games play a little bit better, if you will. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But as far as what I want to see in the Season 3 Reloaded Update or the Season 4, definitely I would love to see it to where we can upload... Or, excuse me, uh, I want to see the theater mode fixed, okay? I know that's not a big, you know, game-breaking change or whatever, but listen, like, you know, not everybody out here, you know, has an Elgato and a, a you know, uh, gaming setup rig to where they can upload, you know, clips and everything like that, and they can stream or whatever, so... At least fix your theater mode, Treyarch. I mean, I understand that, you know, we're in a pandemic, as Blame Troop says. But listen, y'all, I mean, we're six months into the game, alright? The game has enough content already, 
uh, for both, you know, Warzone multiplayer. Now, zombies, uh, oh, Lord. Zombies players have been getting the shit into the stick for the longest amount of time. And I hate to say it, you know, I, I play zombies. I love the zombies mode, but they're the least, they're the least respected mode uh, in, you know, the game right now. So, uh, it, it honestly sucks, but... Fixing the theater mode would just make things a whole lot easier for an amateur content creator like myself. Uh, make it to where we can bookmark games to where we can, we don't have to sit there and be like, oh, was it this game where I dropped the nuke? Was it this game where I kind of sucked ass? You see what I'm saying? I mean, we can do this back in Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4. Why is it not a feature in Black Ops Cold War? Come on, Treyarch. Get, get on y'all shit, man. I, I know y'all got a lot of stuff y'all's trying to do, but fix your game, all right? You know, I, I understand that we're in a pandemic, alright, but, I mean, come on, like, really, six months into the game and we don't have a functioning theater mode, doesn't make any sense. Uh, the aim assist needs to be looked at, I know, I know, a lot of you are probably like, oh my god, crazy Spartan, your aim is just trash. No, it's not. No, it's not. Uh, a lot of connectivity issues as well needs to be looked at. Uh, where I can literally play in a zombies match and if I pause the game for too long it will literally kick me out of the game all right uh, that's not good that's not good for a $60 AAA game like Call of Duty I mean I, I can understand if this game was like 30 or 40 dollars but 60 and even in some cases 70 80 90 100 dollars for a AAA game to where you get kicked out of lobbies because of your connection that doesn't make any sense and then your aim assist is buggy that doesn't make any sense either there was a, a algorithm going around for the longest amount of time or an article that was floating around saying that uh, you know Treyarch or Activision they control your actions mid-match and there was actually a patent about it uh, if you guys want to go look up that patent you definitely can uh, if it hasn't been <laughs> race from the earth already but it, that just doesn't make any sense all right so uh definitely you know some of the things i want to have looked at in the game you know what i'm saying the connectivity issues is a big one uh definitely you know the theater mode being fixed is a big one uh i honestly want to see another weapons pass because let me tell you this car of two right here, this thing is a freaking laser beam, okay? Uh, I, I love using this weapon. I don't want to see it nerfed into the ground, but I, th I think it can be tuned a little bit. I think, you know, you can, you know, slow down the fire rate, you know, maybe add more recoil to it, you know, just do some things to make it a little, you know, less... Uh, aggravating because running into this thing every lobby is literally really aggravating. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. Also, I want to see the snipers catch a nerf. Okay, the aim door. How is it? The flinch mechanic on snipers doesn't make any sense. I could be beaming somebody across the map. Literally, their aim just doesn't go anywhere, and they can get like a clean headshot on me while I'm shooting them, while I'm eating them up with bullets. All right. I, I want to see the snipers looked at. Tony Flame, I know you don't have the same respect that uh, Vondahar once had, so you might not, you might get some death threats if you nerf the snipers again. But listen, I mean, we're we're in the day and age where uh, gaming is a toxic environment already. So you know, uh, nerfing the snipers wouldn't wouldn't do. You know anything other than probably make the the sniper 360 elite no shot or you know uh, you know the 360 nerds out there mad but whatever it doesn't really matter uh, you know who cares so fix the snipers okay another thing I'm gonna be on my DJ Khaled shit another one why don't we have an emblem maker in the game I understand, you know, like, people making, like, swastika emblems and all that other good stuff. Well, what is it with people's gamer tags? Why are people's gamer tags, you know, 
uh, able to have like dick and you know uh, all these other cuss words in it, but we can't make him. That doesn't make any sense. The emblem maker was something that you you could you know create some interesting pieces. I mean, I can understand, you know, like I said, people go in there and they make stupid stuff, you know, about hate crime and, you know, racism and everything like that, but that's where you put a team in charge to make sure that none of that stuff goes on. But, um, those are just some things I want to see in the Season 3 Reloaded Update. Let me know what you guys want to see in the Season 3 Reloaded Update or in another season in the comment section below. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. 29 and 8 using the car of 2. This thing is absolutely ridiculous. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If y'all did, drop a like, subscribe, turn on your notifications so that way you don't miss a video when I upload. Uh, I'm probably going to upload this video today and then work on getting, um, you know, uh, episode 21 out for you guys. Uh, game 7 of the Eastern Conference semifinals. Uh, I believe we're going up against the 76ers. Going, going to a game seven. It's going to be pretty interesting. But uh, y'all go check out the feature channel section. A lot of good stuff there. Uh, links in the description box below. Go check those out as well. And look at this. Look at this. I'm invisible right now. Treyarch, fix your game. But y'all stay motivated. Stay dedicated. Always have that mama mentality. And please, for the love of God, if you're on the south side of the state, like I am, or the country, like I am, I'm in North Carolina right now, please go get your gas, because gas is going, and it's going quick. Alright, be safe, love y'all, y'all stay motivated, stay dedicated, y'all have that mama mentality always, and I'll check you guys out in the next one. Peace out. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.